So, just want to make sure you guys are in focus here. Check out of me if you are or not. I can't see anything through the mesh. Uh, sting me. Yeah, they do. Some of the some of the girls are getting angry with us, so they're stinging us. Um, so Morgan, just lift this up with your hand real lightly. I'm just gonna show you guys something. Oh, uh, isn't that beautiful? That is a beautiful sight first thing in the spring, man. It's it's awesome. This is a full hive. It survived the winter fantastically. So um. Still lots of honey in there, lots of capped honey, so I know I don't need to feed these guys any sugar water. They got plenty of their own stuff. All right, okay, you shut her up there, Morgan. We're gonna close this one up. Okay, guys, Morgan, I just opened up this one hive, and obviously, we don't always have the best of luck. Remember, I was telling you guys about the mice and how they do damage. Yeah, we got one right here. So they've been chewing against this. Then they started chewing here, and as you can see, they could be in this nest, yeah, which they, I hope the hive. they aren't. <laughs> Yeah, because you can see all the debris when we were opening it up. I'm like, ah, we probably got a mouse up top. Because sometimes the mice, they'll build their nests all up inside here, right? And they've got the roof over it. Everything's going. They love it. I'm going to open this. Um, hold on. So, um, I don't know if you guys can see or not. But if you look into our little, no, focus here, guys. Sorry. See the chew marks? That's one of our wood frames. Now, this hive is do seems to be doing pretty good. Um... Seems pretty active, but I'm gonna open it up. Me. And we're oh, Morgan wants to open it up. So here, I'll crank it open first, real quick, Morgan. So I'm just gonna take my hive tool here. Do, do, do. Here we go. And open it up. Now, um, oh, this one's on there good. Lots of propolis on this one. Um, the propolis comes from the tree buds and the saps and out of all the trees. And bees collect it. Um, okay, no. lift it right up though, Morgan. Take it right off. Okay, so you'll see the hive, it's a big hive. So they might have all just kind of coexisted. The mice, the, well, the mouse might have gone down in there, uh, but maybe not. It just depends. You see, he was trying to get in there. Um, yeah, you can see there's a little bit of mold here. It's from the moisture. The bees all clean that up, though, which is really nice. They'll end up cleaning it up throughout the uh, summer. Um, but yeah, so. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to leave it, guys. I'm not going to open it right up. It's just not that uh, good of a... Well, it's, it's important, but if the mouse is in there, he's way down the bottom and he's wrecking the bottom the bottom um, supers. So we'll just leave it until the weather's a lot nicer to open these guys up. I don't want to upset our queen in there. And these guys are really calm. And, and we don't have our smoker today. We weren't counting on opening up anything. We're just going to feed and unwrap. So I'm just gonna leave these guys alone, but we'll mark it so that we know. I think hey, I found the queen. There uh, might be a. Uh, I found uh, the queen right there. No, that's just a female. The queen's probably in here. They're hiding her pretty good. But I'll bring you guys back out and we'll uh, go through uh, how to determine. One thing before we leave, we have a shop. Uh, it's the Métis Honey Shop in Port Dover. <laughs> Morgan's pretty uh, adamant on letting everybody know about our honey house. We have one in Port Dover, Ontario. And just for the viewers that are like in the American, we're just going to say where we are. We're in Canada, Ontario. It's around <laughs> Port Dover and Brantford. So if you come by. <laughs> oh, that's just so. a uh, selling spiel. Good job, Morgan. Okay, we're just going to close these girls up. You yeah. know, if there is a mouse in there, they're not bugging the bees right now. And the bees uh, you know have already what? killed them. Uh, yeah, the bees could have already either shoot it out or killed the little mouse. So the either way, we're going to close these guys up. I'm going to shut you guys off, and then we're just going to keep on moseying for the rest of our hives here. Okay, take care, guys. All right, guys. I'm pretty much, uh, wow, is that ever to focus, eh? Um, pretty much done. I've got a bee buzzing around my head. And I've got my stuff off, so that'll be interesting. Okay, let's uh, check it out. Here's a lazy cat for you. You totally abandoned me. Well, it's hot. <laughs> yeah, it's hot. Uh, I'm sweating my butt off, but uh, he did a good job. He worked on almost every single hive with me except for the last two. Last one. Oh, okay, last one. We'll give him. We'll give him props. Uh, <laughs> oh, okay. It's smoking hot out here. Um. We lost, we lost one hive, so it is what it is, what do you do, right? Um, so these are all open, you can, uh, I don't know if you can even see it on here or not, but tons of bees out right now, the sun is just blaring, it's awesome. So, yeah, so that's it for this yard. 
Uh, one thing I want to kind of point out though, is we try to keep our yards really clean. I hate going by a bee yard and I see it's such a mess. Oh man, it drives me crazy. So anyhow, we try to keep it nice and clean. Uh, you know, key things is one, it's easier to work around, right? And two, <laughs> even though we had two mice today, uh, it does, it really does cut back on a lot of mice. We probably would have had a lot more. So, um, if our uh, yard was really crazy messy. So, so yeah, um, this is our Poraki site. So we're really uh, stoked about having our bees here. We love it here. It's a great yard, great yard for our production. And uh, once again, let's look at the lazy get. Chilling out, relaxing in the Jeep. Nice cool air. I'm boiling, I'm sweating. Not a lot of fun, but. Uh, okay, so now I don't even know what time it is, but we'll have to see what time it is. We might it's be able to make it. It's 1.14, really? Yep. Oh, okay, I just saw a mouse run by. Where? Um, oh, over here. Anyhow, I won't be able to make it to the dump today, I guess, so my Jeep will be smelling like tar paper. <laughs> Nature of the beast. It is what it is. So, either way, I think that's about it. Uh, today, and I'm gonna get out of my gear because I am smoking hot right now. And here we're gonna want to take over some video taping if you want to do any. Doesn't matter to me. Hi. Not right in your face to be nice. It's not right in my face. Okay, guys. See you later. We're gonna post this on our YouTube channel and probably on Facebook as well. So, uh, so yeah. Have a good one.